juggle everything this morning because this is as far as I'm gonna get. The car is not gonna make it it's too low for this curb. So I carry all my stuff all the way around. Yeah, it's way too low. You can see how high the curb is. It's like eight inches. Eight inches. So I'm over here juggling all this. And last I got my wheel in the other hand, the measuring wheel. We're starting a new job here. Uh, you know what? I should probably lock that car too. So you can't see it from where we're working. Starting a new job. We're going to be putting in a pipe uh, fence. A very good customer of ours. I'm trying to juggle all this. Sorry. Getting the pipe fence ready this morning or we're going to start marking. That's why I got the marking paint. Marking the posts, setting those in. Then we're going to uh, start putting it together. So should be a quick one. Should be an easy one. Got this thing all ready for, for uh, some new animals. This morning we're coming through, we're gonna be putting a fence up here, a metal fence like that one over there, pipe fence. Uh, not the chain link, but the painted pipe. We're gonna be coming off of the corner of this chain link yard, taking it straight out to where that can is. I don't know if you can see that spray paint can there. And then across the back, halfway into this uh, shed here. Pretty nice setup. So this whole pin is gonna be enclosed. And yeah, we're gonna put another gate on the opposite side over there. Half of it, like I said, it's and come around here to that metal can from right over here. You can see the post marked to here and then from here halfway into this area to where it'll give one side for the trailer and then the other half for cover for the animals to get out of the rain. Should be nice. We'll put another gate here and then a big gate there. That way if they need to trap them inside here to keep them sheltered for some reason. And then the small gate right here will be for hay for her feeding. So keep the trailer full of hay here and so it's gonna be really cool really easy it's always nice to have gates you know easy maintenance easy access i guess to maintaining the animals whether you know cleaning or feeding or whatever should be a quick one uh daniel's cutting the post right now we're gonna hopefully get those concreted in aaron aaron just went to go get the auger get the post in today hopefully tomorrow we can start cutting the saddles and putting the rails on for sure this week this is monday so I'm hoping even by, well, we got painting. We got to paint it too, so that's going to take a little while. So for sure by Friday, we'll have it all all done. We got to put the wire on it too. So we should have it all ready and have them a nice pin. Fifty rollover. B roll here. We are flying down the highway right now. Some nice curves between Rio Oso and uh, Oslo. We'll really get the car up. Yeah. Around these curves, man, this car hugs, hugs the road. It's just, it's just beautiful. I mean, and it doesn't feel that fast. That's the, that's the thing with this car. Like, yeah, like it does not feel like that. It just hugs the road. It just really hugs the road. You know, I'm, I'm sure most uh, most sports cars do. You know, that's what they're made to do. But you can do it safely. You know, and I would never drive crazy, obviously. You know, around people or you know, if there's a lot of traffic, no, you know, I'm not gonna do that. But light traffic, you know, these cars uh, are nice. It's really easy to be safe in them. Having fun? Headed to Roswell, just left Riedoso. Headed to Roswell next to go check on things there. I don't think I'm gonna make it to Artesia today. Maybe in the morning. Keep the jobs rolling, keep them coming, keep them going, keep them getting done, keep them, keep them everything, just keep everything going. So, so we're here, we appreciate everybody. Like, comment, subscribe, share. Dislike it, you can dislike it, you can whatever you want to do, just do something. Do something. Just do something. That's all we're asking. Do something. So with that, I'm out. The rocket has uh, left the building and uh, we're headed to Roswell.
right guys we are almost done with this job where we're just kind of completing putting the chain link up and painting so the gates yeah that should work These guys are finished right now. We're um, kind of just doing some last cleanup things. But yeah, we got this little cage pin area. Some alpacas, as you can see over there. Pretty much it ended where the existing chain link fence was for the goat pin before. So we just extended, as you can see, over off of that post and came with a pipe fence, which you wanted to do. And then we did some chain link. So pretty quick. Got leveled out and guys are just finishing up painting the gates right now which Aaron welded. We kind of need those to fit the areas there as you can see inside there. That gate opens and closes that little pin right there for if you want to lock them inside. If it's snowing or something, I don't know. So yeah, we got all this finished and I guess when we put the feeder in right there, the water. We got a little mineral feeder I guess for them there. We put some hay out with some straw, I mean all ready to go. So yeah. Yeah, another gate out here, and yeah, it's all pretty much secure for them. Ready for the next one. 